Hello everybody, today I'm gonna show you my new build. It will be a Martian 5 incher version 2 and uh, with 4mm arms. So I have it prepared. I have the build in this stage right now. So I'm gonna tell you my opinion about this frame and how the build goes this far so as, as I said this is a 4 millimeter arm and uh, it locks together in the middle in the X type and this makes the frame very rigid and very uh, stiff also it has a 2 millimeter bottom plate which is also an upgrade from the version 1 so it doesn't bend it doesn't move any parts so it's very very good i'm satisfied with it so far i've installed the pdb with which came with it with the included uh, xt60 and already i did a, a dc regulator here because it hasn't got any so I've added one and set it for 5 volts, which will power the receiver, the flight controller and also my camera of choice, which uh, of course it, uh, using this frame will be an HS1177 from Fox here. <coughs> I'll be using an X4R receiver in SBUS mode. For the flight controller, I have two types. I have the Asperi Sing F3, which is an F3 board, as the name says, and also have the F4 Open Pilot Revolution clone. So I have to decide which one to use, but I think I'm gonna try race flight with this revolution. So I'm curious to test this. I have the DYS XM20Ms prepared for the arms, <coughs> so I'll be using this. For the motors I'll be using uh, DYS SE2205 2300KV motors, so they are the new special edition hollow shaft uh, uh, motors. Uh, other parts in the package are the top plate already, of course, and the uh, camera mounting plates, which are pre-cut for three different uh, camera tilt positions. I think the least one is 25 degrees, the middle is uh, 32, and the bigger tilt is 45 degrees. So anyone can find its favorite. As far as VTXs goes, I'd be using these 600 milliwatts Boscam uh, transmitters with uh, Amway antennas for the moment. I think I won't be using any uh, OSD for this. I don't want so much cabling around. So far I really like this frame and hope it will perform well and also I hope I will feel the difference between this X type frame and for example my ZMR250. Uh, so I'll be reporting back in the future and also if I have the full build, I will show you to you. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Thank you. Goodbye.